Alright, what is up? What is up? As you can see, we are, we are here. Please forgive me in advance, but number one, if I happen to be less coherent than usual, and also if I, if I play worse than usual, because I am very tired right now, and I'm just like, I'm trying to stay awake. I, the, my work schedule is like fucked up my sleeping. And I need to stop myself from passing out, so I jumped on this to play and figured, let's record my sorry ass. Oh, so just forewarning you, it may be bad. But while we're waiting, because apparently these players haven't even picked their characters yet, so we're going to be on this screen for a while, god damn it. This Tuesday, this last Tuesday, some stuff came out. Dragon's Crown and Tales of Zillia came out. I also bought... I was not aware that they came out with like the like a Mass Effect trilogy boxed set for the for the PS3. I wasn't aware of that, uh, and I bought that too because that's the only way I believe. I, I actually don't know. I'd have to check PSN, uh, but it's a little late now anyway. But I believe that's the only that's the only thing that I've seen that has the first Mass Effect available to play on, which is awesome. Damn, Virgil's health just died. Virgil just died. We're happy. We didn't even get to see it, but we're still happy. His life depleted, and we're excited. Um, but yeah, man, Dragon's Crown and Tales of Zillia both are like... Dragon's Crown is, I mean, number one, just for, just a, you know, kind of disclaimer on my opinion of it. I'm not all that far into the game. I think I'm like four hours into Dragon's Crown and like maybe five or six into Tales of Zillia. So this may change, because obviously there's a lot of upgradable stuff, especially in Dragon's Crown. There's a lot of upgradable abilities that you can get as you level up and you buy skills and stuff. So th this may change. But like Dragon's Crown for me right now, it's just like... It's so close to good, but it's slow enough. Like the movement of everybody and like... The motions is just slow enough that it irks me. Like, if it was just a little bit faster, I feel like I'd love this game. But for now, it's like, I, I don't really like it because it's kind of, it feels just too, a little too slow for me. But otherwise, I mean, it is, a, it is a good game, it is a fun game, and I'm enjoying it. But, like, it's just that always in the back of my mind, it's like, if I could just move a little bit faster, if I could just go a little bit faster, this would be so much more awesome. Um, and this dude apparently got X-Factor. What is he gonna get completely X-Factor, Wesker? Please don't, because that homie got his little, I think that's Mexico flag, going down. And that means lag. And I don't want to play it lag. <laughs> Every time I see that flag, it means lag. Okay, good. Um, Tales of Zillia is like, they set the bar high with Tales of Vesperia. I mean, like, maybe it was just me. That's one of my favorite games on the on this generation. Like, period. They have a story that isn't just some, like, overbearing, I can't understand anything that's going on, but obviously it's gonna, it's affecting the world, it's like on, a, on the world stage, not just like a small, you start out as a dude just trying to protect your homies in your small little county, town, village, place, and you just want to go and find the, the magic item that somebody stole. That's it. There's no implications of saving the world when you start out. There's nothing, like, complicated where they're just throwing, like, terms at you that you're sitting there like, why should I care about? I don't know what any of this means. Why should I care? Whereas in Tales of Graces and Tales of Zillia both, they just throw you into, like, this big giant thing where you know that, like, some deep shit is going down, but they haven't introduced any of said deep shit to you. So you just know that, that shit's going down, it's gonna hurt the world, but you don't know what any of it is, you don't know what any of it's doing, you know nothing about it, so there's no reason to care. Tales of Vesperia made me care. They made me like the characters, they made me want to see, find out what happens to them. And that's just the story. They had high quality voice acting, the only character that was even slightly annoying at times was Carol. And I mean, even he wasn't bad, usually children characters just suck altogether he really wasn't all that bad overall um and then you have like tales of graces both actually tales of graces and this game like both have characters a character who's just like this emotion this boring emotionless mad person like thoroughly boring monotone and like the story technically justifies that but like 
you should not just be annoying just because you the character is supposed to be like you should not make the character boring because there's a reason for it like this character is boring on purpose is not a good reason character should never be boring the character should never sound like completely monotone and shit what is this dude doing with nova what are you doing stop it stop it ryu you can blow all of that up so he just sure you can him every like don't even do anything just stand there and sure you can him damn it um I don't know. Like, Tales of Zillia and Tales of Graces F both kind of have the same thing. Like, I hate the stories, the voice acting sucks, and the battles, but the battle systems are okay. The battle systems, I, I guess. And that's pretty much all they got going for them. Which is a bummer, because I, I loved everything about Tales of Vesperia. So I'm disappointed. This trend better not continue for Saints Row 4, dude. Super jump and Lord do that. What the fuck are you doing? God damn it! Holy shit. I, like, I mean, Akuma doesn't have much health, but that last like quarter of his life bar just fucking up and disappeared. Is that gonna hit? That might hit like the tip of his foot. It did. It looked like it might have just been a little bit too low, and that would have sucked. Oh my god, that was it! God damn it, what the- why? 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 You have- why? Uh, oh my god, you, that was so stupid. <laughs> but thankfully, thankfully this dude's too shit to capitalize off that. That should have been an immediate X-Factor death. That dude should have died. Oh god damn, I didn't hit a button. I'm already, I'm already not liking the status of this lobby. I need somebody that's like amazing that's just going to murder my face. That's what I need. I need somebody to put me in my damn place. That's what I need. I need somebody who can match my pace. That was pathetic, I know, but shut up. <laughs> I don't want to hear none of your shit. Time me out too. Cause he timed the last dude out. Which means he's a bitch! <laughs> so yes, he's gonna be a bitch again. And I got nothing to talk about, unfortunately. Like I, I went through everything while waiting for that boring ass match to end, while waiting for the boring ass matchmaking screen to get into spectating. I went through I went through everything. I got nothing. I'm sorry. We're just gonna have to wait for this bitch to continue. I'm hungry. Let's talk about that. Let's talk about what I want to eat right now. But I don't want to go anywhere. Because I'll probably pass out and run into like a lamppost or some shit. Ha ha ha! That wouldn't be good. I want some motherfucking chicken wings is what I goddamn want right now. Fine. Don't jump. I didn't want you to jump. Fine. Don't do crouching light. I didn't want you to do crouching light. Bitch. That was 
cool. I'm gone, I don't even care. And I'm gonna overhead him just for shits and giggles. Just cause I can, just cause I can! I don't know if I got Captain America in that, cool I did. No one curb, bitch! That was stupid of me. That was dumb of me. I'll admit it. Nice mix up, bro. Let me out of the corner for free. Nice. Oh, shit. I was looking at the wrong meter. That was my bad. That was a scrubby play on my part. Shitty play on both of us. Worse on him, though. I'm just saying. Cause I won, so obviously he was worse. I need to get better. I, like I need to regain my godlikeness that I used to have in this game, so I can not be this shitty. <laughs> it's it's not good. It's no bueno. It's just, it's it's bad all around. Nobody looks good doing this shit. The homie just run, homie just ran, homie mad, that homie mad. You can tell that's a dude, like anybody that will run the clock out on you like that for everything is a homie that will get mad <laughs> about shit like that. I'm gonna keep picking the same team this time around because I actually want to try and see if this shit works. I mean, the obvious plan here is to try to use Hawkeye to get in with Felicia and then potentially try to use Felicia to do, uh, 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 what's it called? and unblockable with Nova's assist, with Centurion Rush. But I don't know if that'll work. I don't know how good Hawkeye's assist is for Felicia. Shit. I'm gonna get blown up by Hulk here, guaranteed. I'm just gonna get my ass blown up by Hulk with Felicia. I can handle him with Nova and Hawkeye, but with Felicia, nah. Um, I mean, I guess that's a good use of meter and some. That was stupid of me. Stupid of me, I hit a button and that was dumb of me. Okay, so this dude's random as fuck and he's blowing me up. I ain't even mad about it. Oh my god. What? I wasn't even landed yet. Oops, I hit the wrong button. Oops.
Oh my, okay, good. I almost lost my shit. I thought, I thought Kitty Helper was about to fuck up my combo and I almost lost my shit. But we survived. We persevered. It barely worked. Oh. Oops. I shouldn't pick Felicia. <laughs> I'm just saying. This homie shouldn't pick Felicia. He's not good enough to use her. Ugh, I'm terrible. Why don't these fuckers gotta let the clock run down? Why can't you just hit the A button? It ain't hard or the X button, my bad. I don't know what any of the PS3 buttons are. I still think of everything. Look at that, I made everybody leave. I'm so amazing, I made everybody run away from my amazingness. Suck it, bitches. <laughs> yeah. Who should I pick? Should I rock, Wol should I rock Wolby? Let's rock Wolby. For the love of Pete. This is so bad. Oh my god, y'all don't even know. This is so bad. I'm just mashing buttons because this is so bad. That didn't even combo. That's how bad it is. I am so good. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so good. Oh my god, I'm so good. I don't know how I'm doing this. Supposed to be a command grab and it would have worked! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! How the hell did you time that? What the fuck? Yeah, it moved. Oh, it stopped moving. Yeah, it moved! Oh, do I have auto jump turned on? I must have auto jump turned on. Oh, he can counter that. He didn't counter that. He could have, though. That sucked. <laughs> I'm gonna try. Let's go. I'm gonna leave. Because that was just like. That was all bad. That was all bad. All bad. So bad. That was just a terrible connection. Those other two players, well, part of it was just me picking Felicia, and I need to stop that. I need to knock that shit off. Because I should just, I should not be playing Felicia. Like, that shit just, just should not be happening. But I want to check and see if my ass can gain some rank, so maybe I can get into some more elite lobbies, so that hopefully I can gain entrance into the upper echelon of the Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 online world. If I can, thank you. If I can move past updating player data. Oh, now we're just gonna save for three days. This is great. Fuck you. I should probably just do any any, but like, I don't even. I don't even. I don't even. I don't even. I should just go to arcade mode. Instead of our training mode. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go to training mode.
If I don't get anything in like two minutes after I start this shit up, I promise I won't make you like sit here and watch my dumb ass for seven years. Cause that would suck. This is not a team I would actually use because there's no neutral assist for any of these dudes and they all need it, but... I guess any any and hopefully the connection... Hopefully I don't end up just getting a bunch of Japanese people with one bar connections. Oh my god, I didn't even get the dash in, holy shit. Can she even confirm all that on him? Shit. Yeah, that fucked up. I hesitated there. So let's definitely not try that one first. <laughs> oh, okay. That's not good. That's no good. Let's try, let's see, I need to... Oh, fuck. I need to learn how to confirm that mid-screen, because apparently there's a long time. It's actually tight between... Ooh, yeah, let's rock. Let's rock. Look at that sticking at five bars. And hopefully it's actually real season it's supposed to be sticking at five bars. Look at this homie playing way too much. <laughs> Damn, that's a lot of games. And then my sorry ass, 0 and 1. <laughs> Damn it. A 0% win rate. Oh my god, this sucks. That was dumb of you. Oh my god, this sucks. Might drop out of that, actually, yeah. Not even, fuck it, just kill him. <laughs> I don't even care right now, just kill this motherfucker. Thank God for Wolverine being a god in lag. Thank God for that. Because that was so far away from five bars that Sesame Street has got to take... I gotta watch Sesame Street to reteach me what five actually is. Because it was that bad. It was that goddamn bad. But we, we got our rank up. And if that if, if that if a five bar connection was just that damn bad, I don't even want I don't even want to fuck with it. Fuck it. I got my one and one. I got my perfect 50% win rate on ranked. I ranked up. I'm an amateur now instead of a beginner. That's very prestigious. I'm done. That's that. That's it. Like that's peace out. We we outie. Actually, let's go check player matches again. Oop, nope. I meant let's go check lobbies again if I can actually find the correct spot. Oh no 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 go back, 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 go back. Bad boy, bad, 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 bad. I just realized that this shit, you should be on any. Why doesn't it just default everything to any? Assholes. I feel like I've played that dude before. And it wasn't bad. I mean, like, it, it was bad. Fuck it, let's go with the, let's go with J-Hood. Let's go to the J Hood. We're not joining the lobby, we join the hood. <gasps> oh, look at that, see, see, see? We get a rank up and now all of a sudden we're meeting the, all the prestigious six lords. The dudes that played ranked until they got their achievement and then bailed. <laughs> did exactly what I did. Oh, but look at that, look at that, that's not, that's, that's a, that's a British flag and a Mexican flag and that's not gonna go well. I can't even get good connections on this motherfucker from people down the street, let alone people in different countries, I'm sorry. That sucks, but that's the way it is. It's depressing. 
I just want to make sure like I don't rejoin the same one I was already in, but I don't remember anybody's names. It's too bad Mr. Immortal Bugatu has got... Ah, oh, it's a zero player though. It's too bad Mr. Immortal Mugatsu has zero bars, because that's a godlike username. And I would totally join that room just based on that username. And let's let's check this shit out. Cause as far as I know, we gonna Google this motherfucker. Mugatsu. Is that is it really? Is Zoolander the only Mugatsu? Okay. Looks like it is. Yep. Because, I mean, for all I know, like, I'm sitting here over here thinking I know what's going down, thinking I know what somebody's name means, and then they're like, no, Mugatu is like this famous, I don't know, like, saint that you should totally know about because that's, like, important, vital history, and you should fucking know and you should be ashamed of yourself for not knowing. <laughs> Oops. So I had to Google it to make sure that Mugatu was indeed... That just mean that just means the homie that was in Zoolander. That's all that means. We're actually just gonna spectate this one to make it around 29 minutes, and then we outie because zero, zero is a problem. Don't nobody like zero. Is this motherfucker with the zero letting the clock goddamn wind down? Is this motherfucking bitch? With a motherfucking zero. Letting the mother... Okay. Alright. Okay. I'll calm myself. You motherfucker, you better pick a stage damn quick. That's right. You're goddamn right you won't pick stage that fucking quick. Oh, and he even got the emo black color. I mean, like, I can't blame him. Because base color for zero is godlike. So I can't really, like, knock that. Because if I actually use zero, that would be my color. Because I love me some base. But... What is this motherfucker doing? Yo, homie, Strider. Strider doesn't convert off super jump height shit, and Zero does. You playing right into that homie's gameplay. Stop it. Stop, well. Yo, your team is in the wrong order there, bro. Your team is in the very incorrect order. The best you should do right there would be Dante, Virgil, Strider. That is what you should goddamn well have. Because what is Strider going to do off of Jan? Like, I have no idea how Strider would confirm a hit off of Jan. Yo, those dry teleports into lag bold cancels? Those dry... What's that move actually called? I can't actually remember what that move's called. Is it called Beehive? Yo, what the shit? I was going to laugh my ass off if he managed to land into it, but no. Dude, this guy is doing old vanilla not able to buster cancels with zero combos. This dude just swung on zero incoming. This dude just did... <sighs> it makes me mad that this homie just did, and that's what you get. That is what you goddamn well deserve. You're using zero. You do not do THCs with zero. Or TACs. My bad, my bad. Oh my, oh my god. This is depressing, guys. This is very de What the fuck? This game must be laggy as hell. Like, that's the only possible way I can explain all of this fucking randomness. It even showed you which way to block! Oh my god, he did it again. Fuck this guy. Fuck this guy. I'm out. <laughs> 